Oh well, hello friends, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to be doing a plan with me, and we are gonna be working on Monday, July 20th, through Sunday, July 26th. As always, let's take a peek at last week. So today is actually Sunday. I'm getting some filming in. Yesterday was kind of a bust. I had a planner meetup, but of course, my brain didn't work very well, so I had a migraine, which really sucks. So basically, I like just slept slash relaxed slash let my medication work <laughs> right around here. Um, it just really sucks when you wake up with a migraine. I suffer from migraines. I've suffered for, I don't know, since middle school, like, and I'm almost 40 years old now. They just kind of ebb and flow. There's no real rhyme or reason. I've been on all the medications. Sometimes they work, sometimes they don't, but Anywho, um, so that is that, but yeah, I had a really good week. I had my little Christmas in July spread, which I'm so happy about. I think it looks really cute. Um, I do, uh, for what, I don't know, for whatever reason, I really like the, like, um, like every other day, like going with a colorful theme. I don't know, that just makes my brain really happy. <laughs> so yeah, did a lot of things. Had to deal with my HOA. That was a whole mess, but it's fine. Um, you know, HOAs are great, but man, they suck sometimes. <laughs> Anywho, oh my goodness. Um, so yeah, was gonna go out with some friends, but I canceled that. They actually went and hung out by themselves, which is good. Um, after lunch this day, I just had a, like, I had a salad. I just eat like a green salad for lunch most days. Um, and that's kind of what I was eating this week for lunch. And I just got like the worst stomach problems. So, which is weird. Cause it's like, I had eaten like the same thing like the day before and not had a problem. So it could have been something else. I don't know, but, um, I just need to be close to a uh, restroom. So I was like, I don't think I can make the like 40 minute drive to the place and like have this be okay. So anyway, they had fun without me. Hopefully I can join a different time. So that'll be good. Um, I had a few doctor's appointments. I did another live. I hope you guys enjoyed the lives. Um, I had a question in the live saying, you know, are you gonna be doing um, like a live every single week? Cause I've done it two Thursdays in a row. So I did it this Thursday was my first time. And then this Thursday, and I said, you know what? Maybe it just depends on what you guys want. So if you've made it this far in the video, which it's only been a couple minutes, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Um, Thursdays just work really well for me, like Thursday evenings after work. But let me know. I don't know, I could do like a weekly thing, a monthly thing, I don't know, whenever I feel like a thing. <laughs> I don't know, what do you guys think? Let me know. So anyways, um, oh, I finally paid off my kitchen. So I did my final payment for my kitchen countertop installation. I was waiting for them to send me my last invoice. So I finally got it on Thursday um, evening and then like they weren't open. So then on Friday I called in and just said like, okay, yeah, you can just like run my debit card again. Um, and then now it's all bought and paid for, which is great. It feels so good to pay things cash, by the way. Um, if you guys are new here or don't know much about my channel, feel free to check out my budgeting videos. I'm gonna put a card to my like money playlist. So check those out. But this is last week. This is the planner that I use. I have a link down below to this uh, Franken planner, if you will. Uh, so I use an Erin Condren life planner in the hourly layout. I have a colorful and I have neutral pages in here. So all of my monthly pages are colorful. And then my weekly pages, as you can see here, don't have any color on them. So these are the neutral pages. So I kind of put two planners together to create my own and there is a link down below if you guys want to check it out. Um, there's also a link below for like all the different Erin Conner products if you are interested in those as well. So today I thought I would do something fun. Well, I mean, I always think it's fun. So I, okay, I can get rid of this. I always create my like little like washy and sticky note, like little graveyard <laughs> over here. Um, so yeah, I, need to roll out some washi. So I was kind of like what I do before this, and I don't know, some of you guys know this, some of you don't, it's okay. Um, I like to decide what I'm gonna do for the week before the week starts, like my theme, if you will, because sometimes I sit down to film these videos and I'm just like so uninspired. I look at my washi and sticker collection and I just get overwhelmed and I just don't know, I don't know what to do. So 
I just have a real tough time with that. But when I am feeling motivated and excited, I start kind of not laying out washi, but I'll put like, for example, like I'll take a little sticky and I'll put some washi on there saying like, it's kind of like a little placeholder for me. Just saying like, this is what I, this is what my inspiration um, for that week should be. I mean, I don't know if it's going to be, but it's just a thing. So yeah, I mean, I can always change it at any time, clearly, but um, yeah, it just kind of gives me a little bit of structure. And then with these pages being the neutral version of the um, EC binder, I have so much more flexibility because I'm not working with any other color palette at all on these pages. With the colorful version, there is a bit of color and I just didn't like that. So, and I, I used that last year, um, but you know, I just, I wanted a little bit more flexibility and not to have to like compete basically with that color scheme. So yeah, that's kind of the method to my mayhem there. So there's that. And then, so I'm working every day this week. I just put it in till five, as some of you know that have watched my channel for like ever in a day. Um, I am working from home, as I know a lot of us are at the moment, and thankful that I can still work from home and have a job and all of that stuff. Um, however, I basically just start when I get up in the morning, and then sometimes I'll work till like two or three and sometimes I will actually work until like five. <laughs> just, I don't know. I feel like it just kind of depends on the day to be honest. My, let's see here, up here I need to put some washi because one of my coworkers is on vacation these two days which means that me and my other coworker have to make sure to monitor his inbox. So um, we might have to do some of his department's work. Like he's the same department as, as us, works in a different building. So does kind of different things, but it's kind of the same. It's weird. Anyways, so I like to, I like to note when anyone on my team is on vacation, just because I can kind of remember um, so yeah. Oh, and I should say these little guys here, I'll throw a video up in a card if I haven't already. These are like a washi card project I did and yeah, I just, I really like the way that this has turned out. So yeah. All right. As always, I'm going to use some Coffee Break Planner stickers and I really liked the purple in here, but I really liked the yellow. I'm not a huge yellow fan. Um, I don't know why. <laughs> I've just like never really been into it. But I thought that that would be like a nice compliment to use, you know, like yellow event stickers and then also use some um, like purple accents inside of it, I guess. I don't know. So, I mean, and I like that there's like anywhere from like a lighter purple to a darker purple. So I'm going to use some kind of like, I don't know, mid-toned purples, I think is what the plan is. So I'm going to use these ones. These work stickers, um, even though they're in my little binder, are from Lulu's Daisies and Co, which is always linked down below. And um, I get a lot of questions about like my favorite sticker shops and stuff. I do tend to put like my favorite sticker shops down below, especially um, in these types of videos. Oh wow, that is not centered at all. Good job, Emily. <laughs> um, especially in these types of videos. So even though a sticker shop is there, it doesn't necessarily mean that I used a sticker from that shop in this specific spread, but they're just kind of my go-to places that I tend to order from over and over again. All right. So that looks hella cute. Love that. I love her like scripty work stickers. They're like my faves. I swear every time I place an order, I always order at least like two or three pages of them because um, the way that her stuff is, is she has, so her, what am I trying to say? The way that her listing is, 
it's like a rainbow is the way that you get the work stickers so in order to get them all the same color you have to buy several sheets which i'm not complaining about at all i think that's amazing so that's why i pull them off the sheets and then i do them like this so yeah <laughs> so basically like you get one of every single color on a sheet but i don't know i like it i like it so i mean i use enough of them that i don't really care i go through them enough so yeah, so I have my work all scheduled in, cool. Um, you know, to be honest, this week is like a little bit boring, so I apologize in advance. Um, I need to see if I have any like cute little birthday things, my friends' birthdays. Oh, this is totally the wrong book. Hold on. All right, so I need to see if there's any like cute little birthday things that might be purple actually or yellow well, let's use one of these these are like little ec stickers um hold on here come here come here little friend Whoop. all right so there we go and then i'm gonna put this like kind of in the middle of the day my friend megan's birthday just so it reminds me to, um, you know, send her a text because I'm bad at that sometimes. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna see if there's like a little birthday thing in here. I think that there are a few different birthday things in here. I don't know. I don't really have what I'm looking for. Well, maybe I can do this. Hold on, all right. This is like a whole lot of yellow, but whatever. <laughs> whatever all right so i will send her a text see how she's doing for the day so i'll do that pretty early in the morning here and then i'll put my little happy birthday here i don't really have like too much going on at work i mean i'm busy don't get me wrong but like i don't have any like extra things going on at work which is kind of nice to be honest um but I heard through the grapevine that I'm gonna start training to do something in new. Um, I'll still have my other job, but like training on doing, I don't know, some new things. So we shall see how that goes. But yeah, just doing some cross training is what's actually like really happening. Oh, I should put that uh, birthday thing up on the top there. But not the birthday, I'm sorry, <laughs> like vacation time. All right, hold on, let's do that. And uh, another interesting thing with the pandemic, which I know a lot of you guys that um, are still working and you know, if your job hasn't been really affected too much is trying to figure out how you're gonna use your vacation time. So that has been a bit of a challenge uh for my department well i think everybody's department to be completely honest i actually have a vacation day coming up which will be in august but it's like one vacation day um but i'm like okay well i've got like two weeks to use so yeah i was saving up my vacation because i was anticipating um surgery and all that stuff i'm no longer having surgery uh if you guys don't know about that i will link a video i did a like little medical update thing um a while ago but um yeah it's just really frustrating but that's i was kind of saving all my pto and vacation for that because you know if you have surgery you just don't really know how your recovery is gonna go and you know you want to make sure that you're saving your time for that and that's why i didn't you know i didn't really schedule anything this year um before surgery was even an option last summer if you will my mom and i actually talked about going to san francisco this summer as kind of like just like a summer trip and that clearly is not happening um because i told her like once surgery was kind of an option for me i said hey you know i want to make sure that i'm doing the right thing for me and my body and i just want to make sure that i have enough vacation time and all of that stuff so that's kind of off the table and my mom was like oh yeah no problem and then the pandemic hit and like clearly we can't go anywhere at this point which 
is fine, but still one of those things that's like, ooh, how do I use all this vacation time? So I don't know, I'm gonna figure it out, but um, <laughs> we shall see. I also have some blood work that I have to go do. I've got my little cute little, um, where are these from? Oh, Simply Gilded. I've got a couple of these, but this is all of my Lulu's Daisies and Co stuff. And I know, I know <laughs> that I have a, medical one in here that says blood work somewhere hold on we're gonna find it haha -ha, blood work sweet all right and i will do the purple one here we'll do this purple one so freaking cute i'm like obsessed with her stickers and no this is not sponsored at all um i just love her stuff okay so i'm going in I believe at five on Wednesday to do some blood work. I had some uh, medical appointments last week. They just want to take a look at my labs. They have labs from a while ago that they think they can still use, um, but they want to just double check a few levels and just make sure everything's good to go before I have um, any more medication prescribed to me, which I already have more medication prescribed to me. It's a whole thing. You know, it's always good to double check labs before you start doing anything else. So yeah. All right. And then Thursday night at 630 my time is another NASCAR race, which is in Kansas. So we'll put that there. And then let's put in some YouTube videos because I am usually the like person that's like, yeah, I've got all the videos scheduled and I'm ready to go. Nope, not this week guys, <laughs> not this week at all. So I need to get my shit together basically. So yeah, but um, I'm gonna put in a little, like these cute little layouts or like what are these flat lays? cute from blue scooter press and then this is from libby and lou little planner time cuteness down here and sometimes i do my planner videos um on saturdays but i don't know for, for whatever reason this kind of like reminds me to like get my life together <laughs> and um do that so yeah and then i've got these cute little colorful cameras from adriana piper um let's see see here I think I'll do a yellow one just to kind of tie in with a little like planner time um but oh as I was saying um I don't have my life together this week with the video situation so the only video I know that's going up so far is on Monday which is my plan with me video so I mean I know that beyond that I'm just kind of like burp <laughs> I just oh I don't know guys sometimes I don't know I feel like you guys have this like idea that I've just got my life together and like <laughs> guess what I don't so <laughs> oh goodness I don't know but I'll figure it out so Monday see like I haven't even edited like I'm looking at my computer screen right there because that's where it is I haven't even edited my video from last week of my plan with me that needs to go up this week like this day so we are going to get that figured out maybe i don't know i don't i don't know <laughs> it's just like oh gosh sometimes i've got my life together and other times i'm like what am i doing what am i doing for reals i don't know i just don't know so friday's video should be a monthly budget video um, so I'm gonna put that up. So I'll put that up in a second. And then Wednesday's video, like these might change, you guys. Um, Wednesday's video should be something about learning to uh, save money because that is the plan. <laughs> oh, like I said, I'm usually like a week ahead and I got like two weeks ahead and then I was like, oh, I'm doing really good. And then like, oh, well that didn't work out so anyway taking my little piggy bank thing here looking all cute and then 
I'm going back into here because I've got, here we go, monthly budget. This is exactly what I want right here, monthly budget. Um, yeah, so I've got to get that filmed. I've got none of these videos filmed. I'm supposed to film something for last week. That never happened. <laughs> so, you know, sometimes we just got to make it work, guys. We just got to make it work. All right, and this week, here, I'm going to use one of these little stickers. Um, it says this week. Hold on, we're going to go like this. I need to do a few things and I'm not a person that likes to like write on my pages but we're just we're gonna go with it. I have a few doctor's appointments that I need to make but there's like a referral in the system but they haven't called me yet so at some point I'll be making these appointments this upcoming week so yeah. Okay so got a few more appointments to deal with which will be happening at some point. I don't know if I can do these things over the phone or if they are going to be a like in-person visit, but I will find that out when I make the appointment. Also, forgot the little trash can thing. Hang on, hang on. Got a few little trash can guys here. These are actually from Coffee Break Planner. So I'm gonna put one of these guys in. And then I roll my can down on Wednesday and they pick up on Thursday. I don't know why I'm singing. Oh my gosh, I'm losing it. Ah. <laughs> so yeah, this is the way that my week is so far. Make sure to come back next week to see how this all got filled in and if my plans changed, if they said the same, you never know. If you were interested in anything that I used today, make sure to check out the links down below. Also, I get tons and tons of questions about these little sticker books. If you go to my like Amazon link down below, it's like my Amazon shop or my Amazon page or whatever it's called. These are in the category called planning or planner items or something like that. There's these like little sticker books and I love them. They are very overpriced, I will tell you that, but they work really well and I like that you can use the back side and the front side of the pages, but that's just my opinion. So anyway, things are linked down below if you'd like to check them out. There's also some other awesome planner companies linked down below for you guys as well to check out. If this particular layout is not your speed, that's okay. There are several different planner companies out there and I'm sure one of them will suit your needs and your planning style. So anyways, I'm gonna jet for now. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. If you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe, ring the little bell notification so you get a notice every time I upload a video and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah.